What is up, Ladder Climbers? Antoine Wade, founder and CEO of Black Heights, where we train, mentor, and coach you how to climb the ladder. And in this video today, we're going to be talking about information technology management and why it is a degree that is beneficial for you. So if you're majoring in information technology management or information systems, you are down the right path. And if you aren't and haven't chosen a major yet, give it a try at your school. Talk to someone, talk to me, send me an email, talk to somebody else who's gone down that path. But the first thing I want you guys to know is this. I am an information systems management graduate. I graduated from the University of Wisconsin, Milwaukee with a bachelor's in information systems, management of information systems, graduated in 2005. That was 15 years ago. And I'm doing quite well with just that degree. But let me just tell you guys what information technology management is or management information systems. And the reason why I use both of those terms is because schools are now adopting the information technology management degree to be the exact same as management information systems. So either your school will have management information systems or information technology management. Degree is important because as you can tell, the world is built around data and you need to understand how to solve problems with data. And when information technology management teaches you because it is a business administration degree, what it teaches you is the business side as well as the IT technical side. And if you were to think about it, the majority of people that get a degree in management information systems or information technology management, they do end up working in IT. However, if their skill set and their soft skills are more than their hard skills, typically what they end up doing is working in operations or the business. I, for one, started off in a product development organization, then I transferred to a services organization, doing a lot of coding and a lot of development. That's not typically what an information systems major does in their first role. What they typically do in their first role are things like being an analyst being a data warehouse specialist, somebody who's really good at understanding data, analyzing data, a systems analyst, somebody who understands systems and how they all connect with one another for the business. Somebody who is a SAP developer. Many of you guys know what SAP is, the biggest ERP solution provider out there and they can become a SAP developer. They can become a software administrator working in IT, working on laptops and software and procuring that software in those laptops. They can also be an IT staff auditor and a data analyst. These are all of the majors and there's other ones as well. Software developer, I said, software engineer. My first role out of college was a software engineer. So as I said, there are many, many, many jobs that you can get as an information technology management major or management information systems major. It can go from IT to product, to development, to services and so forth. Now, what does the curriculum of a information technology management major, what does it consist of? Well, it consists of your core business courses. I remember taking 
the accounting, the finance, the operations, the supply chain management, really to get a good understanding of every part of a business. I hated those classes, by the way. But you also are required to take information technology major coursework. And some of those things are visual systems development, where you actually are learning how to program in certain languages like VB.net or C Sharp, object oriented systems development, where you learn how to program in the object oriented language. So, yes, those courses are going to give you an introduction into program. It could be uh, Java, it could be C Sharp, it could be VB.net. It also gives you a better understanding of database management and how data is put into a database and how to retrieve that data from out of databases. And then it gives you the bigger picture of systems and how they interconnect with each other and how do they connect with each other as well too. So the systems analysis and design. There's a lot of courses that you can choose to take on top of those core courses. If you have a specific area where you wanted to get into when you got your first job, you can choose things like web development. You can choose things like AI technology. You can choose things like security. And those are all additional elective courses that you can take to make your skill set even more greater. So I tell people all the time, when you're looking at a job in IT or you're looking at a major for IT, you want to get something that can span across multiple industries, multiple parts of the business and information technology management does just that. A major piece of the information technology management uh, major is the management part you get an opportunity to be the lead in some of your project work. You get the opportunity to manage projects. So you're getting that experience by working with some of your, your peers, some of the people in your classes and so forth. And, um, you know, that's, that's really, that's really a good summation of what it is. It helps you with your communication when you're in a management role and you're working with other individuals and you're leading things. It helps you go into the corporate world already expecting how situations will play out if you are a manager or if you are a person who is an individual contributor. So I think it's the best of both worlds when it comes down to a business degree. Information technology management and management information systems, they are really the exact same. Matter of fact, when I was in school at the University of Wisconsin-Milwaukee, the degree was management information systems. Now I see that is actually called information technology management. Guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope you have learned something. I hope you consider another degree when you are looking for a major going into college or before you graduate from college. Look at information technology management, look at management information systems. They are both the same thing depending on the school and you will be able to ladder climb. I hope you guys enjoyed the video and until next time, peace.